Hello and welcome to a brand new episode of Foodie Jam only on Prudent for fresh, healthy and spicy chats. So IJ, the guest is her. She is a DID Super Mom season 2013. Of course, dance करता ना, choreography करता ना, हम का दिस्तात, zumba करता ना, हम का दिस्तात. Of course, अता एक song जर मन पाजे जाले मैं तो रस्ते से जा रहा था, मैं तो pot hole गिन रहा था. अता pot hole अनि ऐसे ना हो, मचे synonym जाता. That is who. Is the question mark? But Zanun gave who she is in some time. So let's catch up with the celebrity for today. Hey! Hello and how are you? What's up? <laughs> Great. And for the foodie jam on Prudent, we have our celebrity guest, the ID Super Mom, yeah. Cecil Rodriguez. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Cecil, not talking anything about um, your dance, of course, or Zumba, of course. <laughs> we at Foodie Jam are gonna talk more about your foodie side. Yummy, yummy. So, um, what did you have for breakfast today? Today I had chapati and jam. So you are a heavy breakfast person? Not really. Lunch Actually, you're supposed to have a heavy breakfast. That's what mm -hmm. it said. But uh, chapati, Mama's there. She makes. So I'm, I'm enjoying it. Okay. So. And uh, now with your son around, Jake. Jake. What does he prefer? Or you cook for oh, him? Or no, your mom? Cooks? Uh, my mom. My mom's the queen in the kitchen. So you don't interfere. I don't interfere. Two women can't handle the kitchen. <laughs> there has to be one woman who handles it, and that's my mom. She's an mm -hmm. amazing cook, and she makes lovely chapatis. And my son loves the chapati. So yay! Yay! Yeah, so sorted. Chapati. Yeah, sorted. yeah. yeah Mornings are sorted. Started. Okay, great. So, um, how does um, your foodie journey begin? Where you were very small, where did you start off uh, living, and then, of course, uh, how did you uh, change your food habits in school or college, and now? What's your food journey been? I mean, I'm not a fast person because mm -hmm. I've had Hindu neighbors, I've had South Indian neighbors. And more than being at home, I used to be at their house having their food. And my mum would be searching all around, where am I? So for me, Maharashtra. busy hogging. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whether it's Maharashtra food, whether it's South Indian, I can relish any food. Whether it's Conti, name it. I'm a foodie, and uh, I can eat whatever's given to me. I'm no fast spot person. But they actually say, you know, um, if you're dancing, then you have an entire workout that is done, and no matter how much you eat, you are slim and trim. So is that your formula? Simple. Eat and burn. Eat and burn and yeah. repeat. And repeat <laughs> every morning. Every morning. <laughs> Fantastic. So um, tell me one thing. What, uh, as as you said, it's no fuss or something like that. Uh, what was um, those food items that you had earlier in your childhood that you miss eating today? No, I think so. Mum is still there with me. I think so. I'm blessed being the only child. So you know. I still get my home cooked meal and uh, I I don't know what else to say till mummy is there I'm going to get her food and I enjoy it every day so you know basically most of the time it's home cooked meals that mm -hmm. I have mm -hmm. very rarely it's dinners outside with friends or okay. a birthday party mm -hmm. but it's home food uh, every the day. best yeah but in school college whatever uh, did you carry a tiffin or was it canteen canteen no, mom used to give me a bread sandwich, sometimes mm -hmm. it was with egg or something. Oh, dad would give some pocket money where I could buy some samosa or some sandwich uh, which was available. Sometimes like, you know, change in the regular thing because mom okay. and dad both okay. were working. Mm -hmm. So, whatever. So, I, I you, you used to have home food, whatever, different that was packed for you yes, and all that stuff. Yes, yes. What about Jake? Jake still gets home cooked. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. My mom. Mom. Yeah. <laughs> mom is the best. <laughs> Mama, I love you. <laughs> So, um, tell me one thing, it's like, which is that one comfort food of yours? In the sense, give it to Cecil any time and you can have it like 365 days. Comfort food, like I think for, so. For me, if you ask, uh, for non-veg it would be fish curry rice. Uh -huh. Or if it's a uh, veg, then it would be a dal tadka and jeera rice. I can have I, it I, I think so, that's oh, Do you our, have a comfort food? I think so, that's a stable, yeah, because okay. even we, dad is a big fish curry rice person. Mm. And uh, sometimes mom makes dal, same thing, like you know, in that, or sorak. Oh, sorak. Just uh, onions and like you know, the masala mix and a nice chili. So sometimes there's nothing. Oh, egg curry. Egg curry. Egg curry. So yeah. these are the. So main uh, things. mom is in kitchen, so she rules the kitchen. Yeah, 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 yeah. But what is that first time that you went to the kitchen and you made something for yourself? You know, actually, something? I am a good eater, not a good cooker. So 
सो पेट सलामत तो हाँ सो माय मम इज दैट शी रूल्स द किचन बट व्हेन आई स्टेड फॉर वन एंड अ हाफ ईयर इन मापसा आई वीस्ट टू कुक मी एंड माय फ्रेंड्स वीस्ट टू कुक टुगेदर सो इट वाज बेसिकली वीस्ट टू एन्जॉय लाइक द फुल वेज मील सो आई लाइक विथ लॉट ऑफ लाइक यू नो द What do you call those leaves which you put inside with the thadka? You make thadka. Ah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Curry leaves. Curry leaves, curry. yeah. So the curry leaves and you put the mustard seed and you make the mushroom bhaji and the dal and all that. I used to make that oh. more than the chicken wicken and all that. So veggie stuff comfort. Ha! Huh, I told you, no, I like that. <laughs> So chatting on Foodie Jam with Cecil, and of course we knew a little bit about her as per the Zumba and everything else, the dance, the DID Super Mom. But her foodie side on Foodie Jam. But now it is time for us to cook right here at Bay 15 Harbour Grill. Let's go. And welcome back to Foodie Jam on Prudent, right here at Bay 15 Harbour Grill. And we have with us, of course, we've introduced to you Cecil Rodrick. Cecil Yay! Is to you. And of course, we have <laughs> Chef Abhishek. Woo! Thank and you. And we are in the land of the sun, sea, and sand. And here we are going to make some lovely pasta. And that pasta is going to be taught by Chef Abhishek. So Cecil also will be asking you questions. I also will be asking you questions. Yes, yes, please. And again, Cecil also will be cooking, and you also will be cooking. Yes, please. All right, fantastic. So the sun is shining, and the water is boiling. So let's see what is happening. Chef Abhishek, take us through. Take us through. Yes, today I'm gonna make uh, homemade noki with crab meat. Homemade noki with crab meat. Crab, crab meat. Crab meat. Wow. How do we start? Uh, no, first we'll take the mashed potato. Okay. Cecil loves pasta. I love pasta. With the white or the red, I like or whatever. The, the white sauce, but okay. sometimes sometimes the red sauce. yeah. Okay. Who doesn't love pasta? Absolutely. Right here on Puri Jam, and this is the first step. Right here, I am uh, literally uh, resting my hands and becoming a little cool. Cecil is already there. Cecil will be passing the ingredients, and of course, Chef Abhishek will be. Doing uh, what he does best. All right, let's start. Chef Abhishek, the first step. I take the mashed potato. Can I take some flour? That is flour. We mix with the flour with the ma potato, mashed potato. It's a normal refined flour. Yes. That is the reason for the binding. Okay. So to make it a bit harder. Yes. Now we'll add some more flour mm -hmm. for the binding. So you have to keep mixing, keep mixing, yes, rolling. Yes. Okay, wow. And now we're going to add some parmesan, grated parmesan. This right here, yes, right? Yes, last one. If at all we're not pros, then at least something we'll learn of pasta making. I yeah. guess by the end of the episode. And cheese mixed with uh, uh, the pasta. It's like pasta is like amazing in What terms of very rich for? and filling, of course. ये पामसन चीज ऐसे ग्रेटेड मिलती है कि ग्रेट करनी पड़ती है नो सर यू कैन एक्चुअली आई ब्रिंग द ब्लॉक ओके एंड आई विल कट इट द स्मॉल पीसेस एंड वी ग्रेट इट ग्रेटेड एंड देन यू मेक समथिंग लाइक दिस सो ऑल द इंग्रेडिएंट्स व्हिच आर हियर राइट नाउ फॉर द पास्ता यस इट्स लाइक रेडीली अवेलेबल इन द मार्केट यस यस या सो हाउ मच टाइम डज दिस टेक इन द सेंस विल टेक 10 मिनट्स मोर 10 मिनट्स यस ओके नाउ पास्ता डो इज द रेडी फॉर द नोकी यू कैन गिव द एनी फ्लेवर लाइक यू कैन गिव द कलर लाइक बीटरूट नोकी You can give the spinach noki. Oh. You can give the carrot noki, but that is the plain noki. Okay. Only for potato. You okay. can add any color. You can but give if the you, flavor. But if you if you want to say uh, it's a spinach. Yes, spinach noki. So how do you? You add can add it? the spinach puree in this. Puree. 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 So I'm gonna add the spinach puree. So can you make uh, something which is in mixed color? Uh, yes. <laughs> for for spinach. for actually you can have this for the carnival. <laughs> And this is what spinach. That is the spinach. Okay. Blanche is finished and very puree. Uh, okay. Just plain. Yes, plain. Okay. Look at the color change. Yes. Wow. It's turning green. Nice. If I ask you Cecil, your top 5 food preferences or 5 dishes that you absolutely love in Goa. Uh in Goa, if I normally go I sometimes try out uh 
pasta is what I like. That's okay, my that's favorite. One. Yeah, and either seafood pasta okay. or chicken pasta based on okay. what they've labeled. Uh, then I like Southeast Asian cuisine. Mm -hmm. So either it's a Thai curry or uh, you With have plain the rice. dim sum. Sorry. Dim -sums? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The dim sums. Okay. Yeah. So I, I enjoy that. Mm -hmm. Then you have uh, kafriel. Aha. Uh -huh. uh, okay. So kafriel and you have. The choris pao mm. and you know these are like the staple, the kind, staple of kind of yeah. But if Cecil's I Cecil's favorites. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, light green in color now. Yes. You can see the color changing. And spinach is very healthy, so healthy, it's amazing. Absolutely. Yeah, it's very good. I can I touch the texture? Will be. Yes, please. Nice and soft. Wow. Okay. Now you wanna cut like small this small pieces. Be equal. Uh, yes. Of measurements. Yes. Wow. Now we'll take fork and we'll give the shape. Oh, yes. yeah, the shaping. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is time to look at master. Very class. simple. You can put the noki, place it with the thumb, roll it. Are you serious? Yes. What are you saying? It's that? No, it's simple for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Practice makes perfect, yes. and that is the example. Wow, look at that. You want to try one? You want to try? Cecil, try. Please. I will try later. Okay, Cecil. Alright, okay. So these are not the rumblers on the road. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I keep it here. Okay. Yes. Press, press it. it. And turn. Put on the middle finger. Middle finger, middle finger. Middle finger. Yes, roll it. Oh, wow. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. You're done. Dan, this is something which is really interesting. Dough is very soft. Yeah, it's very yes. soft. So sometimes you can have all different colors in one also. You all have spinach, uh, yes, ma'am. Yes. You can mix can all together. Yes, yes. Now my noki is ready. Then I go for the blanching. That is the hot water for the boiling point. It's 100 degree. When water is the boiled, we can put the pasta in the water. Okay. Now you're gonna put the pasta. The nokis are getting dipped in. Are dipped in. How long do you keep the chef? Uh, pasta boiling generally taking 12 minutes. But that is the homemade pasta. We take uh, five minutes. Homemade pasta takes only five minutes. Five minutes, yes. Others it's 12 Others minutes. 12 I know. minutes yeah. Yes. Wow. Now my noki is there ready because my noki is up. Oh, once it's up. How, how do you know? Yes. It's like it comes yes. up. It's going up, come, come up. Okay. So my noki is the blanch already. Oh, nice. Yes. That is the basic. Indication. Yes. That is the cooking technique. Wow. Lots to think and lots to learn about Italian cuisine today. Right here at Bay 15 Harbour Grill with Cecil and Abhishek. Alright. Now we take out the noki. Wow, it's like the white background with the spinach gnocchis. Wow. Now you Looks apply so some delicious. oil. Okay. This is like regular oil. Yes. That is the mm. olive oil. Olive oil. Yes. Okay. Pomace oil, olive oil. That's for it not to stick. Yes. You can mix it nicely. So you don't mix oil here. Yes, you mix no. oil here. Yes. Yes. Okay. For the Italy, you need the, the olive oil. Olive oil. Yes, now we're going to start for the cooking preparation. Okay. All right, it's time to turn the tables. Of course, uh, Chef Abhishek will go on the other side and let Cecil come right here in between. Yes. And uh, as the ingredients are being told, Cecil, it is time for the cooking. Done. you got to pass it to me. Yeah, yeah, I'll pass it to you. Chef, tell me. Okay, you're going to first uh, take the oil. Okay. It's oil. oil. One spoon? Yes. One spoon of olive oil. You can take some chopped garlic. Chopped garlic. Thank you. Yes. You can take some chopped onion. I love garlic. Garlic is amazing. More? Yes, little more. So this is how many? Around Half. 10 grams of yes, fine. chopped, finely chopped onions? Yes. Now we saute over till the golden brown. Okay. 
So you usually घर पे होते हो Then what do you actually love to eat? घर पे home style माँ का खाना माँ में से yes माँ जिंदाबाद Now we can take कनकसे tomato कनकसे We can take five spoon Five spoon Yes One Yes. Three. Four. It's almost over. Five. And five. Yes. I enjoy one quote. It's like if you love what you're doing, you don't work a single day in your life. Oh yeah, very true. Okay, now we come with the crab meat. Finally, Finally, the crab is here. Okay. Oh my God. The crab is here. The crab is here. Yes, you can put two spoon so, uh, crab meat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, how, how, how do you do this? In the sense, you take the crab. Yes, you take the crab. Uh, just uh, break it. Okay. Yes, break it and take out the meat from Fresh. the crab. Yes. And then how do you make it so fine? Uh, it's like yes, shredded. Shredded. Yes. Shredded. Okay. So it's nice this is hand shredded? Yeah. Yes, it's shredded, the hand shredded. One more spoon. Okay, I love crab meat. I'm putting a big spoon. Wow. Wow. Look, see yum and see the colour in that pan. And actually it will be a really good combination in terms of when you have the spinach the yeah. and the red. My mouth's watering, is yours watering? I'm already drooling, it's like <laughs> the sea right now. <laughs> Alright, so here we are. Now you can add some butter. Big, small. This small. I think we're gonna take this one. Yes, 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 you can do it, oh, Sasin. Ready? Yes, Sasin. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so there is olive oil, there is butter. Yes. That is emulsion of olive and butter. And there is uh, parmesan. Yes, you can finish with the parmesan. Now you yes. can take basil leaves. You can basil. give the flavor. Now time for the flavor. This is basil leaves yes. only used for the flavor. Yes. And it smells so good. Ah. You so can, you break it? Yes, you can break it. Ah. Break it in your hand. Yes. Oh, when you break? The you flavors are flavors. exactly. Yes. Wonderful. Look at that color now. Yummy. Now I want to add some salt and pepper. One this is pinch. like freshly grounded pepper? Yes. Okay. One. One pinch. Little bit. Fine. Alright, one pinch of freshly ground pepper. You can put some salt also. Salt. One pinch or? Yes, one pinch please. Swad anusar that they say. Now our sauce is ready. Okay. Yes. Just keep aside, the sauce is ready. Okay, now. When I come for the noki. You know what is the opposite of noki? Loki. Loki. Okay. Back to. <laughs> so now uh, you need to add oil inside? No, you can add butter. Butter, butter again. Sasil. So eat and burn, remember? Eat and burn and repeat. Oh God. Okay. Go back. Too much? Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes. Easy. Now we can toss with the butter. We hit the noki. Mm. We can add some flavor. We can put some basil. Oh, this also you can. Yes. Oh, wow. Okay. Nice. I like when the flame. This is professional. Like At home, we'll be like. No, in the sense, we would require something which is uh, triple the size of this. If you would like to do something with that. The butter, the noki and spinach, the basil leaves, oh my god. And if this goes into that nice. sauce, wow. And how can we forget Mr. Crab? Alright. And look at the magic right now all the way from the Italy. First we'll put the crab meat on the base. My mouth's watering. Yes, yes. Patience. I know, I know. I'm holding it. I'm focused. Focus. Sabra ka phal pasta hota hai. The pasta plate, the red sauce, the crab meat, the basil leaves. Now we're going to further we put the noki on the top. So is there a for pattern that you follow? Is yes. Style yes, 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 yes. Like, yes, oh that wow. is the whole parmesan. Okay. 
Okay. You can uh, peel with the peeler. Peeler. Yes. That is the flex. Long. All right. Wow. And what is this? this uh, that is the garnish. That is the tuli. Tuli. Yes. That is the flour and oil. Flour and oil. Oh, yes. Which flour? The refined flour. Refined flour oh, yeah. and oil. Then how do yeah. you do it? Uh, it's very simple. You can put on the hot plate. Flour and emulsion. You can put on the hot plate. And we add some color also. Red okay. red color. Okay. Yes. Oh. Just put in the hot plate. It will be <laughs> cooked and we'll uh, turn it like this. Yes, turn it like this. Oh wow. Now for the garnish. We can add some paper. And we have some smoked oil. Oh wow, you can, wow. You can get, get the flavor. The aroma is just fantastic. Now pasta is ready. Yeah! Chef Abhishek right here at the Hubble Grill at Bay 15. This is the magic. It looks gorgeous, absolutely. I know. You can just tear at it. <laughs> but Cecil, I know. It has to go in the tummy as it well. It has to go in the tummy. Wow, absolutely stunning. So, wow. Ekbar or Chef, let us know the name of the wonderful dish that you have prepared. It is called? Noki. Noki. Yes. Noki. Noki. So, uh, the cooking is of course done and it's time to taste the gnocchi in some time right here on Foodie Jam, only on Prudent and of course at the Harbour Grill at Bay 15. Let's go. Jam on Prudent uh, with Cecil Rodericks and we have uh, the Patrao of Bay 15 right here at this brand new after the Harbour Grill. Uh, we'll talk about that. We have Dominic. Hi, Dominic. Hi, hi. Hi, guys. Uh, we are right here at uh, Bay 15, the Harbour Grill. This is a brand new place that we're sitting into. We'll come to that later. But uh, of course, uh, when we're talking about uh, Foodie Jam on Prudent right here at Bay 15 and Harbour Grill, we usually give a bouquet of flowers, but uh, right now, let's yeah. enjoy a welcome yeah, yeah, yeah. drink. All right, so watermelon drink, a welcome drink. All right, blue lagoon with a blue blue sea. And for Dominic, it's something in green. What is this kiwi? It's a flying kiwi. A flying kiwi. All right, so uh, not just, just, yeah, just, yeah, yeah. just, yeah. just, yeah. just for food. Thank you so much. All right, so um, we will sip into our drinks, but the very first question that we'd like to ask uh, Dominic is uh, uh, it's like Bay 15, quite a few years that's in the picture, but today we're seeing Bay 15 in a different color altogether. Tell us more about the journey. Yes, Bay 15 has started in the year 2013, yeah. Uh, the name comes from it because as you see behind, we are located by the seaside and there's a bay of water coming and the latitude is 15 degrees. So that's why it's Bay 15, please note. Latitude is 15 and the sea, of course, the bay, so Bay 15. All right, further. So right now we claim this as the village of happiness. And it looks like it's a small village of Orchard. It was uh, densely populated with nice coconut trees around and giving that go on village feel. Uh, yeah, so that's all about that. So we try to decide to give the same feel and create a, uh, the partition of three places basically. Right now, what we got is we have a wedding venue, we are well known for destination wedding. Absolutely. Venue. So we do about a thousand covers out there. Then we have a disco, which is recently opened up. It's called Club Enigma. Okay. It's another new thing which we have started out here. And yes, where we are sitting, this is called the Lido Deck, which is just going to be launched today. 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Congratulations. All the best. Thank you. Yeah. So this is going to give you a beach type of feel and you know a shack type of feel where you have one unobstructed view directly looking across the Marmagua Harbor and all this stuff. Yeah. Beautiful setup. Absolutely. So uh, the other thing that we'd like to ask you, what we prepared was pasta, but you are coming up with a festival of pasta. Yes, uh, soon we'll be coming up with a festival of uh, Italian pasta. Uh, Abhishek is one of my senior sous chefs who's out here. So he'll be running the festival for about a week. And he's going to do all homemade pastas, which is going to be soon displayed out here on the beach. He'll be cooking live for the guests out here. Oh, wow. Okay, so it'll be a live small satellite kitchen where he'll be cooking for the guests. The guests can interact with them and choose a pasta, choose a sauce. And there he goes. And it's all homemade, it's all freshly made, so it's nothing in the package. Voila! Maybe we have to come here. Absolutely. Okay. So, when are the dates, by the way? Uh, mostly we're looking at by the 19th of November. Okay. So, we're, we're going to run it for a week or so. It's okay. going to be during the IFI week. Uh -huh. Oh, nice. Yeah, so we're going to have a pasta festival. Great, super. So, uh, the plates are here. We've already cooked the pasta. And it's time to enter that pasta. Loki, right? Loki, Noki, 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 Inoki. It's time to make the tummy a little happy. <laughs> so coming about this also, we have, uh, we have rooms around here. Mm -hmm. uh, we have 16 cottages, cabanas. Okay. They are fully equipped with uh, all the amenities inside here. So we have a nice beach view. So it's, it's it's like a complete package if you see it. Yes, you you have a venue, you have a, a, a restaurant which it's it's again multi cuisine. Multi cuisine. It's global. Plus you food have food. yeah. Plus again you have a desk where you can party as well. And for a family, what better place than come for a celebration or just for a eat out? Plus we have a new gaming area where we have carom and we have pool and we have football, darts and. Cards. A day at anyway. Bay 15. Yeah. <laughs> God, never gets old. Okay. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. A little that Rabbit. you have cooked. And you? Oh wow, it's so soft. I should be not talking in my mouth, but it's really yum. I've never. Pasta, so I mean, so amazing, so soft, so, soft, so yummy, so colourful and this is only at day 15, so the festival is coming up on the 19th of this month. So you got to come if you are a lover of pasta, this is the festival that you will definitely enjoy, till we enjoy of course our gnocchi. Absolute yum. Another episode of Foodie Jam right here at Bay 15 Harbour Grill. And uh, this time uh, with Cecil, with Dominic, enjoying the lovely pasta served. A uh, very homely service. A uh, very awesome place for the family and friends to come and just hang out for the entire day, of course. And if you have events to do, it's like the best place, of course. Bay 15 is the place to be. If you're getting married, the one only, only place. Absolutely. So go ahead, uh, we are enjoying our pasta till we meet with our next guest at a brand new location sometime very soon. Keep it locked to Foodie Jam only on Prudence. We are here at Bay 15 Harbour Grill enjoying our food. See you then.